Stephen, new manager of Saudi Arabian Pro League club Al Etihak, what first attracted you to this multi multi rich unlimited pots of gold billionaire club? Yeah, of course. Look, um, I'm finding it very, very tough to keep my emotions in at the moment. I really am. Um, this is my dream come true. Uh, everyone knows when I was a young boy playing football on the streets of Liverpool uh, with me Al Etihad kit on. Um, I dreamt of leading the boys out at the what's it called? Uh, the, the the Prince uh, Mohammed Bad Fad Bad Stadium. Um, that was always my dream. Um, I grew up in a little village just outside Saudi Arabia called Heighton um, and that's why I'm here. It is my dream to manage uh, Al Etihad, it really is and um, it's got not honestly that's my reason for coming here. It's got nothing to do with the four hundred and eighty two million pounds I'll be getting paid a week. Yeah, of course. Right, and 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 do you actually know anything about the Saudi Pro League, Stephen? Yeah, of course. I'm a massive fan of the, the Saudi Pro League. I've not missed a game since the league started. 25 minutes ago, um, some of the teams, Al Nasser, um, Al Shabab, um, Al Hilal, um, Al Pacino, uh, Al Murray, Al Gore, um, and you can call me out by Paul Simon. Um, you know, we'll challenge all these teams and get in that top 25. Yeah, of course. Well, the players must be very excited. You are a big name. Have you managed to speak to any of them since your arrival, Stephen? Yeah, of course, uh, today we had a training session, I wasn't too happy with the boys, um, I said to them I wasn't too happy, they weren't really understanding the instructions, so I said to them, look, it's very important now that the, the English language is learnt, um, so I promised the lads I'll go and do an English course tomorrow and learn, and learn the language, uh, because they couldn't understand the word I was saying, uh, they didn't understand any of my methods, um, which to be honest with you is exactly what happened at Aston Villa, uh, so it's not the first time and that's why Villa went out and got a, an actual, real, proper football manager uh, and binned me, and that's why I'm here, this is my level. Yeah, of course. Last season wasn't great, Al Etihad finishing one place behind Al Fatih. I thought Wayne Rooney was, was coaching in America. No, Stephen, I said Al Fatih. Not a fatty. Oh yeah, yeah, that's what I meant, uh, Al Fatty. Um, yeah, I, I, listen, I promise all 22 of our fans that we'll we'll close the gap to to, um, to 16 points next season. Yeah, cool. Well, one of the absolute goats plays out here, and rumours are you met up with Cristiano Ronaldo. What did you say to him, Stephen? Yeah, of course, I met up with Cristiano Ronaldo, and I just said four words to him. Wayne Rooney says hello. Uh, obviously, that was straight after the two left uppercuts and the right jab to his head, the goofy blade. Yeah, of course, I'm here for the dough.